In this video, I'm going to show you different angles you can get with your DJ avatar and we will we'll check out the difference between Roxy Stab and Gyroflow Stab. Let us start with the ultra wide angle which was not on the DJ FPV. It offers you a 125 degrees angle which is 5 degrees more than what we had on the DJ FPV. What I really like about this one is that it gives you a more immersive experience. So throughout the video, we will check out different ones. And at the end of the video, you'll be able to tell which one is your favorite. Let us switch now with the wide angle mode with the Roxy stabilization. From the moment on I started to use the DJI avatar, I configured it the same way my DJI FP was configured and I could tell that the Roxy stab was much better on this quad than on the previous one because this one gives you the Rocksteady stabilization number two whereas on the DJI FPV you had the Rocksteady stabilization number one it's been improved the next mode we are going to watch is the normal mode it gives you a more cropped view and it's up to you to decide if this is what you want i mean like the different mode you can choose i think will depend on what you're trying to tell because sometimes a ultra wide angle will be more adapted but all these modes serve one purpose is how you plan to tell your story so uh, just going to anticipate on the last footage i'm going to show you what i like about the dji avatar is that dji gives you the ability to fly in a wide mode and you don't have to select the Roxy stabilization but they give us the opportunity to stabilize our footage in the gyroflow software and um, before this video ends I'm gonna tell you I'd rather use the wide angle mode with the gyroflow stab then with the rocksteady stabilization it is much better the rocksteady stabilization is decent but the gyroflow stab is better let me know in the comment section which one you prefer cheers guys